You are one vicious son of a bitch. Next to Mother's Garden this whole time. No wonder we can never get in there. done here.
Here. Boy. Ah, I was wondering about this. That would explain the hefty magical lock on the outside. But it's more than that. I have this feeling. Like something is waiting for us down here. You have a knack for ominous statements, lad. What kind of something? I'm not sure. Something powerful. Whatever you feel, boy. We will handle it. We have come this far, yes? Yes, father.
know what we're still doing here. Another Valkyrie. A Valkyrie? Imprisoned? She actually did it. Lemire? Take caution, lads. A Valkyrie in the flesh. I can't think of a more formidable opponent. me from my corrupted form. You have my eternal gratitude, but my sisters remain trapped as I was. Take my helm. Find them. Free them. The fate of the Valkyries rests on your shoulders. of the Valkyries. Sounds pretty important. That's putting it mildly, lad. What do you know of them? A fair question, and yet not one easily answered. I know more than most, but much of their history is veiled in secrecy. My own experience with the Valkyries ends with my imprisonment. You are avoiding the question, Head. As I said, brother, it's complicated. I don't know why or how they become such wretched creatures, but perhaps if we can free more of them... 
want us to find more of those things? The fate of the Valkyries, lad. A more worthy endeavor there is not. It will be dangerous. Well, that hasn't stopped you before, eh? Hmm. That's the spirit. Betray us! To me! I'm coming! I'm coming! Work it is. Now what else do I want it to?
We have to save her. Think before you act. Are we prepared to face such a powerful foe? I'm ready if you are. Aye, same here. If that counts for anything.
Thank you for releasing my physical form. I have only gratitude. Why were you trapped? I am uncertain. My mind... still fragmented. The Rokestol of Valkyrs. It is the last thing I remember. The what? Valhalla awaits. I must return. What is that, Mamir? It's a council chamber of sorts, hidden away in Midgard. The Valkyries would often need a place to confer outside of Odin's prying eyes. They thought themselves properly concealed, but the Allfather sees all, so the saying goes. Where is it? Remember the room with the eight thrones? I think so. We've been to a lot of different places. It's to the left of the two oarsmen statues. I didn't call it out for what it was at the time. I didn't know for sure. Think we'll find out why the Valkyries are like this? That chamber held a special significance for them. We'll find something there, I'm certain of it. Atreus, follow me.
what for? another Valkyrie. We're gonna save her, right? If by save her you mean brutally rip her wings off, then my vote is I. Enough. Both of you. I will decide the best course of action. Prepare yourself.
This one is louder than the last. Milady, please tell us. Why were you in this physical form? Why fight us? I do not know. The soul of a Valkyrie cannot remain pure in a physical body. We belong in the spirit world, which is where I now go. Goodbye! I... I wouldn't want to speculate. You know something. Ah, Mimia, the smartest man alive. I know many things. Head? Ah, uh, Sigrun, the queen of the Valkyries. She would have that power. The last time I saw her, she was corporeal herself. She came to visit me long after I'd been imprisoned by Odin. Why? Well, we had history, I guess you could say. Like... Romantic history? Ah, oh, lad. You're making me blush, I think. Can I still blush? First we hunt these creatures, and now we chase your former lover. We do not need this distraction. It's more than a distraction. Father, these are Valkyries. They're the ones who keep the dead from overrunning Midgard. Then they are terrible at their job. It's not their fault, brother. Someone changed them. Kept them from their duty. The Queen? I can't say for sure, lad. We should ask more of them. If, of course, you don't mind the distraction. Atreus, to me!
Another. Ah, you know this one, don't you? It's Thamel, the giant stonemason. Is he building a wall around Jotunheim? It was to be his masterwork. He only wanted to protect his people. Too bad the first part got burned. I prefer the last panel was burned. Such a senseless pity. It's another Valkyrie. Are we doing this? On my action.
freed me. Who did this to you? I remember only pain. And my queen. She locked me down here? But why? Ah, oh, Sigrun. I must leave you now. I must find her. I must remember. Sounds like your queen is responsible, Head. Aye. When I saw her last, she was different. Changed. And not just that she was in physical form. She was more volatile. She... I tried to talk to her about it, but she had just come to say goodbye. I didn't think. I'm sorry, Mamir. We'll find her. Not sure she wants to be found. I just don't understand why she would do this. It doesn't make a lick of sense. And if she is responsible? Then we'll have to stop her. The Valkyries must be freed, and we are the only ones capable. We? Well, who do you think's gonna watch your back? What'd you break? Come back soon with more crap.
wine. A mist its gentle breeze in the sweet smell of honeysuckle and blood. Well, judging by the sky, the Light Elves are in control of the light this time. Explain. You see, the Light Elves and Dark Elves... ...are always fighting over the light. That part we know. But did you also know that control of the light has changed hands no less than 213 times? Really? It's true. Each side believes itself the rightful keepers of the light and argue they're simply fighting for survival. But the fact of the matter is, the war has been going on so long, they don't know who they are without it. Nicely done! So, clear this up for me. Spotify means... Land of the Dark Elves, right? Right. But you said the Dark Elves have been here now for a really long time. And anyway, aren't dwarves supposed to be from Svartalfheim? They don't look like Dark Elves. Don't you think so? Then you are vastly more perceptive than the Aesir. They're the ones who apparently can't tell the difference. And they're the ones who came up with that name. Dwarves actually call their home realm Nidavalir. So the Dark Elves aren't from Svartalfheim at all? Not even a bit. They're just elves of another colour. Nobody knows who came first, but they all come from Alfheim. Why do they fight all the time if they're really the same? That is adorable. Huh? It is the way of the world. Oh. Well, that's sad.
Let me guess, there's a Valkyrie in here. Yep. Well, are we gonna fight her? There's a trapped spirit in there. Quiet, Head. your queen did this to you. But why would Sigrun hinder our duty? That's the mystery we're trying to solve, milady. Can you think of any reason she would have to do this? No. Without the Valkyries, those who died in battle will not see Valhalla. Helheim will overflow with the souls of the departed and drown Midgard in a sea of vengeful corpses. No greater shame exists for a Valkyrie. I must go. Attempt to staunch the bleeding. Farewell. I believe you have your answer, Head. The Queen opposes Odin. She imprisoned the Valkyries to defy him. Sigrun hated Odin, no doubt about that. But her duty, her responsibility! Would she really forsake these things to get back at Odin? I don't believe it. I do. Hate is stronger than duty. We have to find the Queen. We have to stop her. I'm sorry, Mimir. Aye. Don't be sorry, lad. Sigrun brought this on herself. Only wish... Well, wishing only gets you so far. How will we find her? I'm afraid I don't know. She could be anywhere, any realm. We'll find her. We have to. All of Midgard is counting on us.
get you squared away then. Right. Lots of luck.
it's another Valkyrie. Can we try to free her? Mm. We can't just leave her like this, brother. Do not rush me, Ed. When we are prepared, I will attack. Freedom. Where is your queen? My queen? She did this to you. She's letting the dead take over Midgar. This cannot be. I didn't want to believe it either, milady. But we have to find her. Where is she? I can't say for sure. But the rock stole of Alkirs. If the Council of Eight are reunited, perhaps she will answer our call. We have more Valkyries to hunt. Aye, lad. But at least we know where to find secret. But where do we find the remaining Valkyries? Other realms. Good thinking, brother. Muspelheim, Niflheim. Sigrun would have no qualm with interning our Valkyries outside of Midgard.
Atreus, here! I'm open. Come back soon with more crap you found.
Freedom. Yes. You are free now. My sisters, have they suffered the same fate? Yes. But we'll save them. You are both very brave. I wish you luck. Valhalla awaits. Both? She didn't even notice me. good for you. You know, most... Parents just want their children to get a full night's sleep. So, what can I do for you two? Fine piece of work, if I say so myself. Now, there is something else to tell you.
Shouldn't we save our strength for the challenge? Careful, lads. Ready yourself.
That's right, milady. You are free. You have destroyed my physical form. I have nothing to give but my gratitude. I guess that's all we need. Gratitude does not pay for weapon upkeep, boy. Valhalla awaits. Farewell. Looks like this was our last one. Aye, lad. Onto the rook stole our Valkyrs then. If you remember, it's next to the two oarsmen statues on the path we took to Thamur's chisel. This queen of yours. She is strong, yes. Stronger than these other Valkyries we have faced. That's putting it mildly, brother. Then we must prepare ourselves. is impressed. He says for anyone that can beat a Valkyrie, he'll unlock a new level of challenges. I think all the swords just came back. It says we can go this way.
I can't believe no one has found the Jotunheim Tower after so many years. Where would you hide something that big? Amir, how'd you come to be in these lines? Bad. There comes a time in every man's life when he changes his name and heads north to make a new start. If you live long enough to do this many times over, you might end up as far north as this place. By the time I arrived, I already knew Odin by his reputation, and so I set to demonstrate my worth by coming to him with something I knew he'd value. A mystic well of knowledge. Or rather, I should say, a well of water laced with enough mystic mushrooms to make a god see visions. Oh, he was greatly impressed. And we'll pick this up later. Aye, lad. The Council of Valkyries. The Valkyries are of Valhalla, are they not? Glad to see you're paying attention, brother. You are correct. Valhalla, the great hall of the Ain Heriar, is their home within Asgard. But while there, they are subject to the scrutiny of the Allfather himself. And relations between the Valkyries and Odin were... tense during my tenure as his advisor. Why? Well, that's an even longer story, lad. For now, why don't we look around for some clues? placing one of the Valkyrie Helms on a throne. Oh, Amir, who is she? Gunnar, Mistress of War. After any conflict, big or small, she would be first... on the scene, sussing out the worthy spirits for a free trip to Valhalla. A gruesome task, but she took great pride in it. Any conflict? Impossible. It's true. She had help from her sisters, of course, but Gunnar was always first to arrive. Her judgment of the Fallen was unparalleled, and an invaluable resource to Odin. She was one of his favorites. Sorry, lad. The sight of Gondul always took my breath away. Gondul had a silver tongue, a sharp wit, and struck a figure so stunning it literally drove men insane. Odin forbid her from setting foot in Midgard after a time, as insanity is not a welcome trait in Valhalla. This is none other than Gerdrifo, the master of arms in Valhalla, responsible for arming and training Odin's Einherjar. Is what? 
His army come, Ragnarok. The entire reason Valhalla exists, you see. The Ain here he are, wait in the Great Hall endlessly, feasting, drinking, and fa- Ah, uh, fornicating themselves silly. Once Ragnarok begins, Odin calls them into service to fight on his behalf. Deirdre Fool had her hands full training that lot. This, my friends, is Kara. Now, Valkyries are volatile by nature, but Kara, the lass is Wild Storm personified. A Wild Storm? Aye, calm and collected. Then the air would shift and the fury of her storm would unleash. It was beautiful in a way, assuming you could find proper shelter. Her tears would cleanse the blood soaked battlefields. This is Rota, a chooser of the slain. I thought all the Valkyries did that. Not exactly, lad. Although that is what they're most famous for, and by far their greatest responsibility. You've seen what happens to the dead without the judgment of the Valkyries. Hellwalkers. That's right. Rota, Gunnar, Skuld. Without them to clean up the aftermath of battle, hell overflows with souls meant for Valhalla. A sorry state of affairs. Rota must be beside herself. Ah, and here we have Air, the healer. A Valkyrie healer? Strange. Air was strange, as a matter of fact. Very quiet, very calm. Where her sisters were violent rapids, Air was a gentle stream. She healed the wounds of both mortals and gods, and even a certain all knowing sage who once drank too much and fell off a mountain. Ugh, not my proudest moment. Well, well. Hildar, mistress of battle. She and Odin got on quite well, actually. Her and the other Valkyries, not so much. She would spend most of her time here in Midgard observing discord between the living, and sewing some up herself from time to time. She lived for conflict. Some say she was conflict personified. I wonder what will become of her now that she's free. Old Rune, once the daughter of a powerful chieftain. She fell defending him during a reaver attack. Old Rune was escorted to Valhalla, where she chose to devote her afterlife to the pursuit of knowledge above all else. Quite unusual behavior amongst the constant drinking and feasting of her fellow Valhallian denizens. How'd she end up a Valkyrie? Odin. He saw a kindred spirit in Old Rune's single-minded pursuit of knowledge. He appointed her as a Valkyrie's resident historian.
Thank you, friends. You have saved the Valkyries. Sigrun, how did this happen? Namir, is that you? You have been freed, but... Freedom comes at a price, milady. You speak truly. Countless winters we serve the Allfather. But only through his union to the Queen did we ever taste some measure of freedom. But aren't you the Queen? There has only been one Queen of the Valkyries, the Goddess Freya. When Odin severed her wings, I served in her absence, but it wasn't enough for the Allfather. He used an archaic piece of magic, corrupting my sisters. I tried to contain the damage by imprisoning them in places where they could cause no harm, but soon I lost myself as well. Sigrun, I'm sorry for being so worthless. I could have done something, or tried at the very least. What will you do now? I must reunite with my sisters. Together we can restore balance to the realms. You have the eternal blessings of the Valkyries. We did it, I suppose. You don't sound very happy about it. It's difficult to be happy about anything when you're a reanimated head. I'm grateful we were able to set the Valkyries free. But so much of this could have been avoided, if only... You said it yourself, Head. It does not matter anymore. The past is the past. Well, that's awfully cheerful coming from you. I am in a good mood. The dwarves will make use of this helm. Your dad's a wee bit single-minded, isn't he, lad? Definitely. Freya is the Valkyrie Queen? She never told us. You never told us. Explain yourself, Head. Or are you bewitched again? Not at all. Freya was Queen of the Valkyries at one point. Part of her marriage dowry included overseeing the Valkyries themselves. As a powerful Vanir goddess, they revered her. I never knew how much until now. <gasps> What'll it be?
Check back soon. where we left off. Really? Shouldn't we save our strength for the challenge? begins.
behind you, brother. <laughs>
right side, brother! <laughs> my lead.
few extra to deal with back here. You met the boy, of course.
Prepare yourself, boy. Yes, sir.
There's a way through! Ready, boy.
What's it gonna be this time? boy. What's it gonna be?
You take care now.